welcome, sir. Thank you. You are welcome, sir. Like that, let's see if you want to play football. What's it concern you? Oh, madam, come on, come on for here. You're talking about this. Wait, go and open that boot, bring out the box, and take it inside. Hey, if I if carry can as you come now, so that you go to plug me the talk. I'm go bring your charger, the cord. Carry the cord to come. Make it the wipe me the cord for neck. Fool, foolish game. Hear me. Oh. Obviously, I'm talking to you. Come out here. I said, open that boot, bring out the box, and follow me. No, they touch me. I go, I go wound you. I know they're good mood though, I go wound you. I don't open the boot if you want to go carry back, go carry them. Do not waste my time. I am giving you this as a command, not a request. I said open that boot, bring out the box, and follow me in there. Now here, now this company the one day wise. I don't see say you know wise, and now here, then they pay for teachers. If not, I will teach you. Make you guess it, but you know you ever guess it. He's freshening up. He's going to come down soon. Good. <laughs> I don't understand what you're saying. What are you talking about, Mr. Lee? Oh, the same thing I'm talking about. Uh... <clears throat> Look at this beautiful couple. <laughs> <laughs> ah. That. You're looking so good too. I know, right? <laughs> I missed you so much. All oh, thanks to both of you. But honestly, I want to thank both of you for the love. Thank you for the care, the support all through my educational days in the United States. I pray that the good Lord will continue to keep both of you in good health. Long life and prosperity in Jesus' name. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. You're very much welcome once again, my son. You're looking good. I know, right? <laughs> I want to tell you that it is our responsibility as parents to give you the right education. And that's what we did. Yeah. So welcome back after Thank all you. these years in America. Thank you, Dad. Yeah. So I am so happy to see you once again. I have really missed you. And I missed you too. <laughs> I missed you too. I know. So, Dad, how is business? Talking about business, that is the reason why you are back. <laughs> you promised the world and I fell for it. I put you first and you adored it. So fast in my forest. And you let it burn. Hello? Really? All right. Mr. Collins Okoro, you welcome back. Let the beginning begin.
this is not your first time telling me to stay away from men. To hate them with passion. Because you don't deserve to be made in the image of God. Fine. I grew up not trusting any of these men. But the look on your face, you look so mean. I can feel the hatred burning inside of you. And you are fixed, ready for vengeance. You're right. When I flash back how life has not been easy for us, I guess I've always been on the run. Abandoning everything I have worked for just to keep us alive. But now is the time to stand and fight. Now that your son is around, it's the right time to stand and fight. Ended. When they would have lost their so called empire and the early thought he has. That was the vow I took. I want to see the chorus feel the pains, the agony they made me. Pass through all those years. Kate, for over 10 years I have been preparing your mind for this vengeance. Let's get it done with for your late brother. Son, I'm ready. Yes, don't to work, sir. Harvest, Ali. Yes, sir. The Collins couldn't even wait for me. He's such a hardworking young man, better than his father. Oh, don't go there. Come on. I have single-handedly and successfully moved Dawn's furniture international. We are now a worldwide recognized furniture company. Our rivals cannot meet up with us even if we stop production for one year. So my dear, don't take my old age for weakness. I am just relaxing to enjoy what a younger me achieved. <clears throat> and where does my credit come in? Oh, come on, my dear. <sighs> my dear, just from the beginning, without you by my side, I wouldn't have had the spirit to push on the motivation to surpass my colleagues. And that is why you are the best wife ever. I love you, baby. Do have a lovely day. Thank you. <laughs> Where is she?
situation. Give me something to do. I'm off to bed. Please wake up on time if you want us to go to work together. Oh, I will, my boy. Son, is the food not thirsty? I'm okay. Your guess is right. Good night. Prepare this rubbish. Not me, madam. Then who? Is Eno, madam. Someone her immediately. <clears throat> I think it's uh, time to hire another chef for this household. What your meat are preparing now? It's no meal. It's nonsense. I used to eat very delicious meals in this house. But these days, the food is like roadside food. When I can be able to employ the best chef, in this country. I think I've had enough of this. Look at my son. Enough is enough. She will be in a sharp limbo, so you have to exercise a little patience. She's your sister. I know and trust her well enough to handle our food. Yes, madam. Yes. Young lady, ma remind me your name. Kate. I'm Kate, ma. And you can prepare all the food listed for you. Yes. Yes, ma. Yes, ma. Well, I am only employing you here because of your uncle. He has been of good behavior, and that is why he has been working with us all these years. If you will respect yourself and respect your employee and face only that which brought you here, which is your cooking job. 
you will not have me to contend with. She has been employed, right? Good. That's a wonderful start. You're not happy. Why? Why should I be? I regret ever allowing you to use me to get Kate into that house. Rose is risky. Rose is total evil. I know she's going to investigate who Kate really is. I know. That should not bother you. I have it all covered. Be calm. The risk is worth taking and she's prepared for it. Her working at the office should have been perfect. But with the security cameras everywhere, it would be impossible for me to carry out my plans. That's why I want her in the house to get full dose of our revenge. Full dose? Yes. Don't tell me you are going against our plan and you've decided to kill them. Don't tell me that. Not at all. I don't want their blood to be on me. Rose, contact was not part of the plan. Or are you up to something? Watermelon baby. <laughs> How you doing now? Fine. Mm, see, as they employ you new now, eh? Now I say make I can do some important introduction so that we could live here happily to avoid quarrel. You hear? Mm -hmm. uh, you see me as I did here now. Hmm? My name is No Binze. The only son of Igo Binze, King O Binze, in O Binze, Imo State, is a small London. I be prince. Forget I day here, they open this door up and down, wear this uniform. I just day here now, so that they, they know they see me as lazy and giant youth. They get me? Anything where my, my papa just close eye now, bim, they say he don't die. My coronation don't go on. Really? And they tell you, no be play. So as you see me here now, make you the attached small respect, you get? Mm -hmm. Meanwhile, for the award where I get for this side where I day now, let me be D-A-N. Chairman G A N Gateman Association of Nigeria. Let me be their chairman. Okay. Then the C A S O S for this state too. Chief Security Officers for the whole state. Let me still be their chairman. So make you know. Now nah, I know the ordinary Gateman. In fact, the thief where I don't catch. The thief where I don't catch. Nobody. As in, you know, get who feed do. I'm Guinness Book of Record to serve no fee keeper. The security is for this area. Even if they begin catch thief for 20 years, they don't feel much thief. Where as I did, where I don't pin down. Wow. Mm -hmm. That's interesting. <laughs> you really have titles and a history of a brave man also. <laughs> you talk of bravery. Now we now. You know if you talk any brave man without starting from me. <laughs> Even this one, what I tell you, Seth, and I just 
the small side. <laughs> I never even enter the main thing, you know. Now the summary, now it be this. <laughs> when I go reach the main side, you go know. Interesting. Well, my name is Kate. I am the new chef. Or you can as well call me the new cook. I don't know now I come here. I hope you understand. I know saying that you be the new cook. Now I make I can't say, make I can't tell you. Oh, okay. uh -huh. You see all these things, why I tell you, not this award. You go include them where they give me food. Mm, you know, say, for you to enter here, you get people where do the election. You get people where fight for them. You get people where they for Senate. When we do the work, we make them demote some people. Come bring you, come up. You get, do you get. Uh -huh. So if you want to give me food, just no saying a prince you won't feed. Nobody they feed me like because of this clothes where I wear. Mm -hmm. Attach respect to my food. Oh. Mm -hmm. I Okay. Go on the wait. You ought to go. <laughs> Alright. I'll be back to the kitchen, eh? Take care, eh? Where are you well? Where are you well? I don't have one. Come in, you don't have shape. I know you now. So it is because you want her to be loading your food. So that your food can look like upstate. That is why you took your time to be preaching to her. You took your time to be preaching, just like a preacher that did not go to a, 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 a seminary. Useless man. All you know in your life is food. There is nothing inside your head that is left apart from food. Nidia, Nidia, you know. See, it is with me for this life. Anytime where I see person where frustration won't kill. Mm -hmm. You see, as frustration drag you from that place, you know? Yeah, where you they wash clothes, you know? So, frustration carry you from there, come here. If to say rope today here, and as you they reach here, you go just put them for neck. You go go. And if for sweet me, where, well, where? Well. What you, Sabi? You, Sabi, cook food, and they come out to you from that kitchen. Bring better person. Come, 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 kick, kick you throw away from kitchen. Mumu, where they cook nonsense? You know, see, as I the host now, because better cook don't come. When you they cook before, you they see me when I they come tell you, say, fool my food, or carry up, or carry them down. You know, they possible. But as they bring better cook now, you know, see me, my belly don't be very important. I need to tell them things and things not to do. Things to do and things not to do. Mumu, just there, they, they, they do anyhow. Winch! Winch where they fly for afternoon. They fly, fly for person, come and they anyhow. One day, I'm go kill you. As I tell you, that's so it be. Ah, man. I make it more than Kai. You cannot do anything. You see, that's them bomb. Listen to me. That's some of them bomb. Now I them just pop a from that kitchen. Oh, that's some of them bomb. So I like it. Come in. So put a tag at you. So put a tag from that kitchen. You go to the gate now and close the gate. Idiot. Go to the gate. Yeah, go to the gate. That is your office. You see, that's some of them bomb. Go back to your gate. Hey, go back to your gate. Move. You need to be very careful so that she won't have any doubt to suspect you. Be careful and be smart. As soon as I get the drug, you will receive it. I wish you all the best. Hmm. Hmm. When you face difficult times, be yourself. Don't give up, cause time is the best. It's God that gives joy. It's not human being. Just know. Hey, I'm me. I have a sin member. Hey, Jesus. That means the blood of Jesus. Where did you get all this quantity of food from? I am talking to you, answer me. Where did you get this quantity of food from? You did not even use one egg. You carried a full poultry on top of one plate of rice. You cannot answer me. Oh, you cannot open your mouth, Otoa. I see it. I know you are not the one 
that went into the kitchen to dish this food for yourself. Because I, you know, I am not too blind not to see you if at all you went to the kitchen to carry this food by yourself. You know, Bangutong, the superior is telling me something. Yes! Oh, she is the one that dished the food for you. Mabel! I miss her, but she's the one that gave you this quantity of food. But you know what? Just give me a little time. I mean, short time. I will definitely get to the root of this matter. If you go back here, then you go see time in plenty. Choose the shortest one. If I go see the one, will be like dwarf. You need short time, Abby. Take the dwarf time. Move. I just leave you. Make it just the talk. Make it just the waste. Waste talk. Just the talk nonsense. You know this house, you know they see what they go on. You know they see the changes where they come, Abby. You know they see changes. You know they see them. Make I tell you. The truth be said, we will not go even give you sack later for this house. Before the sacking go start, you go down there your village, you start another business there. Yeah. Mugu. Because me and on a day here, on a day, they cook no sex, they give me half meal. Half meal. New government don't end. Yeah, we day here. Enjoyment don't start. When I go still remain for three square meal, we will not enter six. She said, me, are you there here? They joke. Come on, carry your dead body, come on for here. Oh, no go. You are talking to me like that. You are talking to me in that manner. You mean I should carry my full body and go? Dead one. No problem. Dead one. There is no problem at all. But remember, like I said, just give me a little short time. I will get to the root of this matter. Okay. The same Mugu. Mugu. I did hear the where Madame de Chateau. Go call, go call, oh, oh, be Make it on generator. You know if you remember what he tell you. The generator, you know if you remember, now the food be your problem. I go go punish all of you. Now we don't want my, my success for this house. Fools. Chai. This egg na swallow. To chew this one, not to waste a mass swallow. There is something very important I want to discuss with you. Yes, it is obvious that since you came into this compound, you have been feeling yourself. You even have the cause to be carrying your shoulder high like a shoulder pad. That is why you do not have regards for people who have been working in this compound. Who are the bosses? You are not loyal. And it is even more obvious. That is why you have been given that gate man, the useless gate man. You have been overloading his slave with food. But you know what? Look, let me tell you something. I want to pass a very important message into your skull. I, Enoba, I am here to tell you here and now that if you continue in that particular manner in this compound, I will be left with no choice and to tell Mother that you and that kid man have been sleeping together. together. In fact, the kid man is the person that been helping you for your peace to come and strip. Stay off my business. The next time I hear you mention my name, I will stab you to death. Make sure you bleed to death. Stupid! Difficult times be your same. Don't give up, cause time is the best. It's God that gives joy, it's not human being. Just know that difficult times are not sent to destroy you.
Yes, I am ready for plan B, and I'm yet to receive the drugs. Relax. The drugs got to me late, and your uncle Mike, who is supposed to bring it to you, traveled out of town to return in five days. Okay, fine. Why not I come take the drugs, since I'll be going to the market by four? No. Don't try that. See, Rose boys could be at the wrong place at the right time. Relax. All right, fine. You just have to be fast about it, okay? Um, why, why? Never you sneaking on me again. Do you understand? And what the hell are you even doing here? Why are you following me about? Sorry, oh, no vex. Ah, I don't know say this thing will be you. I don't define you since. I don't walk everywhere. I don't even enter the kitchen. They find you, I don't see you. Now I walk and come outside. I come see you, they make come. I thought you've had lunch. What are you doing here? Why are you a fly? Why are you fetching around me? No vex, see. No vex, I beg. See, I, 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 I food where I chop since morning. I begin purge. I don't purge like five times now. The whole thing just wash away like that. Now say make I find you come, whether you go get more back up if you give me, make I take over their bed. Leave! Just leave me leave. Leave me alone! Get out! Get out! Come, come. Just come here. I don't know, you just like getting me angry. You like upsetting upsetting me. I'm sorry, I know I'm not, I'm not I don't mean to be angry at you. Just that you are annoying. You keep fetching around me. You keep sneaking on me. You keep following me around like a fly. I don't like it. Who knows best? Why don't this thing suppose best you? Hey. Fine. How long have you been standing here? Not today. I don't stay here since now. What? And I lie. I lie. And as I just did it, I say make I stop. Now you self turn. Okay. What do you want? My food. Just give me small food, make I hold. Anything where you want make I do for you, even if not to wash plates. I see plates way back there. I even see pepper where you keep on top of that place. I feel help you grind them. Even if not to entertain you. <laughs> Have entertainer. One, one man more poor. Now they see like this. Entertain me how? You don't know me. They call me Abba Michael Jackson. Now this thing I take the tough food when I die. If I run out for you, eh, you go shock you. <laughs> so anyone who you want, just tell me. I go do. I'm provided. Say you go give me better food. My chop now. Just food. Hmm? Just food. Good. Follow me. Thank you.
when you face difficult times, they are heading to your hospital. It has just begun. It's not reminding. Just know that difficult times are not sent to destroy you. Why don't you concentrate on this car you're washing so that you can finish in time before Madame comes out? You know she'll be mad at you if she comes out here and have to wait for you to finish washing this car before she goes out. Yes, hold on, Abek. You said she will be mad at who? You know. So how did mad take on size? How did madness now take affect you? Because you're not the same. You're not going to shut up. Nobody use your mouth now. Say if she come and she go, they mad at me. So how is they concern you? Why not? You just go here and I begin to talk, talk, talk nonsense. But where did they even carry on and come? Eh? Because you could just come. People where they employ never talk. You will be saying you stand for this gate. How many days they beg? Before they even just manage carry you come inside. Go still they talk to me. You know how many cars why I don't wash for this company before, before they carry you enter here? Now you won't begin to correct me. Tell me how to wash car. I know, I don't even blame you. You know the song where they sing this place? Song where they say now, now the song where carry my Kedasin come this Nigeria for the first time, for 2014. Hey! When my Kedasin come, ga, a, 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 win our award. You know the song? You don't do anyhow. Don't die, since Who tell you say you don't die? Okay. Who tell you say, you know rumor? You know when they don't they rumor them? Rumor, rumor, say you don't die since. See, they come finally find, find out say you don't die. You know when my Kedasin die? I'll be when I sing the song for you. You won't hear them. You must be joking. Do you think I'm a serious person like you? Do you think I am a serious person like you? Hey, I want to be serious. You don't know where people wear their serious they day. You don't know where they, they keep them. For much money. Come on, come up for here. Mugu. For God's time here, make a you song whenever it is, they block your eardrum. Mugu. Don't begin to teach me. Big gas. I don't know where they carry on a come. Because, because people wear no get left with full time. Less privilege, let put this time. Good day, Michael. You can sit. How was your journey? Yes, ma'am. You called for my attention. Spill it out. I'm all ears. Madam, it's obvious that your husband need to have some break from work. If possible, let him step down and hand over to his son, Collins. Thank God the young man is very hard working. At least that will help to calm down Chief's sudden heart problem. Yes. You see, the doctor actually advised the same. Madam Chief is one man that hardly takes his eyes off his business, even when he is in his sick bed. He's that kind of man. You won't believe it. That Chief would often ask me in two hourly basis about his shipping line, how it's going, even when he's in his sick bed. Not when Chief is supposed to be asleep. Think about it, Madam. You're right. 
I will discuss that with him. Just do that. Do not give him any option. Make him to accept, please. And what makes you think I can impose a decision on him? walk away from me, especially when I'm on the right. You are not on your right. <laughs> Don't you ever deny what I'm sure is final and that is what you must do. yet to get your reply and it's pissing me off no matter how I smile about it pretty angel I'm sorry sir I don't think I can do it I'm sorry I know it's not what you want to hear but what you're married. And secondly, you're my boss. So, what is new about your silly excuses? If I revisit your circumstances and condition, even your qualification for you to be my Secretary, you are the least I will consider. But I had to bend the rules because I want you on my bed, not just a secretary. And here you were telling me trash. I'm sorry, sir. I have a healthy relationship. I'm engaged. And I love my man. You love your man more than you love your job. With all due respect, sir, they are not in the same group to choose one for the other. Now they are. So, choose. Are you putting my job on the line? Maybe, or maybe not. But it all depends on you. Thank <laughs> you. 
face with hot stars Be a shame Don't give up Cause time is the best It's God that gives Joy is not reminding Just know That if God dies I'm not sent To destroy you You have 48 hours to meet my demands. Still awake. Oh, well, it's just uh, 12 a.m. I was replying to my foreign partners. But I'm done now. Lest I forget, I will be traveling to Abuja later today. With her, right? Don't look at me as if you don't know what I'm talking about. Please don't insult me. What do you even see in her that interests you so much? Is it about her size or her age? I am not ready for your insults this morning. Good morning, 
sir. Good morning, sir. It's past 48 hours. It's obvious you don't want to comply. This is your last chance. I will be traveling with you to Abuja today. 7.45, last flight. When we return, I will decide your fate. Hello. He's giving me a second chance. He wants me to go to Abuja with him. When we return, he will decide to sack me or not. Don't you think I should quit already? Maybe what we are looking for is not here. Never 
Uh, she um, she went for HIV and pregnancy tests. Yeah, HIV is free, but the other one is positive. Three is gone. We get to know. We get to identify the person responsible. Um, should we take her out? Wonderful day, my love. Your breakfast is ready. I'm waiting. The test messages keep coming, day by day. The one I got this morning is life-threatening one. I think I should resign already. Please, I have to. I went to another pregnancy test. The baby is still growing in me. the main reason I want to resign. My life and that of the one growing in me have to be protected. It's obviously a child that wants to stay. So I have to resign before they carry out their threat. I'm scared. Empty threat or not. Let me just walk away. We can still get what we want in another way, please. Okay. Good morning, sir. Good morning, sir. See me in my office. There is nothing hidden under the sun, they say. You are not even as mature as you look. 
your services are no longer required here. You can type your sack later if you need it. You can suck me, sir. Why not? You got what you wanted from me. I didn't allow it to affect my job in any way. I've given my best to this company then and now. So, there's no reason to fire me. All you did is vanity. Just leave my office. I'll pay into your account the little you worked this month. Good day. It's not nice working with you. I'm not about saying this to hold on to my job. But don't just say a word. I know you are pregnant. I also know. No. When I met my husband, he had nothing, absolutely nothing. After sweating and dropping my blood for him to be rich and famous, you want to come and share him with me? You want to reap where you did not sow? I approved you being his secretary because of your age. Little did I know that a he got also likes older women. I want you out of this office before 10 minutes. Do not return or expect anything if you want that nonsense you are carrying. If you want to raise it, times be your safe don't give up cause time is the best it's God that gives change it's not human being just know that difficult times are not sent to destroy you The guy is ready, sir. No, but I'm not going out with you now. No, sit down. I want us to talk. You have been my very loyal driver 
all these years. You know most of my secrets, which of course I know are still very safe with you. I want you to do something for me. That is uh, Anne's new location. I know both of you were in talking terms before I fired her. I want you to secretly find out from her if I am truly responsible for her pregnancy. Yeah, I got the information. I'm already on my way there. Oh, oh, if necessary. No problem. No problem. I got you. Alright. We have to go back. How has life been treating you? As you can see, I'm fine. Chief Donald, now know that you are here. Are you aware? How does he? Just tell. I don't know. Please don't tell me I have to run again. No, you don't have to. I think Chief's major concern is to find out if actually he is responsible for this pregnancy. And that is why I am here. So, what do you suggest I tell him? Tell him whatever you want to tell him. That bastard is out of the picture for all I care. My please, can we talk about something else? Tell me, how is Madame Rose and the pregnancy? Hope it's going well. We thank God. Mostly we thank God I should be leaving for America very soon. How is Chief Donard managing his male secretary? He has no choice. That is what Madam wants. Chief, on the other hand, is busy frolicking with some young, young girls out there. And Madam Rose frolicking with younger boys. <laughs> what a couple. That's not my business. That's not my business. My major concern is that you stay safe, okay? I must be on my way now. That's all right. Thank Just you for checking on me. All right. <clears throat> Let me see you off. Thank you so much.
when you face difficult times, be your say, don't give up, cause time is the best, it's God that gives joy, it's not humanly, just know that difficult times are not sent to destroy you. obviously disturbed that I know that whatever it takes has not gotten out of hand. No, not at all. I am just pondering on if I will accept the partnership with a foreign company. I mean, it's not supposed to be a pain in the ass to you because the deal is definitely going to take dumb furniture to the next level I mean the international market <laughs> you're not supposed to give it a second thought so use your brain and do something meaningful and allow the deal to flow I will do just that I need you in the room now I said now. Cause great things takes time to manifest, to manifest. Cause great things take time oh, to manifest, to manifest. We shall conquer where is the heavens of promise. But prayers, prayers. We shall conquer worries, never so, never so problems. Prayers, yes. prayers, prayers, we shall conquer. Hello? Worries, never so, never Hello? Prayers, uh, what do you have for me? What hospital? And what condition? Alright. Good. Now, listen to me very well. Make no mistakes. Fetish a girl child. She's free. I have nothing to do with her anymore. But if it is a male child, I need my son to kill the mother. I need a positive result. Right? When you face difficult times, be yourself. Don't give up, because time is the best. It's God that gives joy. It's not humanly. Just know that difficult times are not sent to destroy you. Yeah, hello, madam. We are at the hospital already. You can do it. Try, try. It's coming out. Push. Take a deep breath. Take a deep breath. Push. Try, try harder. 
Push it. It's coming, it's coming. It's coming out. You can do it. Just try, okay? Madam! 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 It's okay. We terminated the mission. You guys have tried. Finally, the game is over. I won. You should have told me you needed a child badly. I would have been carrying this pregnancy long before now. Chief Donald Okoro. I underrated you. Never knew you would go this far. You underrated me? <laughs> Look, let me tell you. I will kill even my mother if she comes close to you. That you're still alive is because I still need you to be alive. Don't give me reasons to believe you are useless to me. If not, I will break down this empire I built with my blood. Your guys are impressive. I would like to work with them when matters arise. Get yourself ready. I do not want to miss my flight. Uh, this is the biggest moment for Dawn's furniture. It's a big turnaround for us. Uh, 25 years ago, I achieved bringing in the Chinese. Now it's your turn to bring in the Americans. <laughs> and when they partner with us, we will be unstoppable in the furniture world, sir. <laughs> Do not worry, Dad. Yes. I promise to make you proud. That's good. Have a nice day. Thank you. Very well. <laughs> you do. Eh? I wish you well. I said, call my wife.
don't forget you have a heart problem so you don't overload what you brought upon yourself. When we are not without a child, your heart do not trouble you. You are the one that so needed a son, so learn how to deal with it. Oh, teach me how to deal with it. Teach me. How could he miss such a meeting? How could he? Oh, well, any meeting one misses could be properly reconfirmed. Is that all you have to say about it? You are not even bothered that your son missed a high profile meeting of such magnitude. The boy, Mr. Kim, has complained about. And he's now adding this to it. He's just proving that he cannot have a good working relationship with Kim San Lee. Well, all I sense here is a battle of who should be loyal to who. And I think Mr. Lee should be loyal to our son, Collins. He should try and understand the boy. Is that all you have to say about this? Is that all? Excuse me. Have it. I will not have it. You punched Mr. Kim Sir because he was mad at you for missing the meeting. Do you know the implications? and what your stupid attitude will cost my, my company. But I do not care. If they want to pull out, let them do so. You are insane for saying that bloody nonsense. Do you know how much hard work I put all these years to build this company and you want to fall it? I have been in peace with the Chinese for 25 years, making easy money and also the money that I used to train you abroad. Is this how you pay me back? Father, I'm sorry for the pains my action must have cost you. But I was trying to tell that little boy that I am the boss. You are not the boss, and you will never be the boss. I have always felt that I will regret handing over this company to you. The money I use for your education is a waste. And now let me tell you, if Mr. Kim pulls out of this company, Consider yourself out of my life. Father, you are taking this too far. Don't call me father! Donald! Don't you! You don't have to pull down the roof because one Chinese man might want to pull out. Let's say our son here wants to write the rooms. How do you mean? How do you mean? Don't tell me you're supporting this stupid boy. Yes, I am. Because his father here has been weak over the years. Allowing that short Chinese man to rule over here. He should be happy that your son here is not ready to dance to their tune. If they want to leave, then let them go. Don't furniture is a household name before the Chinese people came. Uh, Mr. Kim, I, I am sorry once again for what my son did. You know, that will not destroy our relationship. What are you talking about? No, what are you talking about? That cannot be done. What nonsense are you talking about? Look, look, now listen to me. Listen. Mr. Kim, I may have been very calm all these years, 
That doesn't mean that I am stupid. Don't push me, because if you push me, I will show you how brutal I can be, Mr. King. What nonsense are you talking about, you bastard? Nonsense. What did he say? That he wants to take over the company. What? in this compound. You are just seated here, the racks, eating cucumber just to stabilize your blood tonic. There is nothing that is bothering you in this compound. In fact, you are not even an occupant. Uh, wait, wait, I want to understand something. I want to understand something. This can about which? I be lawyer. I, no, I want to be lawyer. Now me be police commissioner, I be commissioner of police for this state. No, what's in concern about it with overload? How big man go to get issue? How should go to do what I want? You go concern get man. The Chinese man who I got the quarrel with, he, he come, are from China. Which kind of nonsense be this one now, madam? So you not concern you? How you take concern me? So now when they pay salary and they not pay you salary, now that time you go take concern you. If they don't pay me salary, I go make sure say concern you, okay? Even though okay, you go concern them, why they not go pay me salary? Hey, why they not going to pay me salary? What thing concern me for the problem where they the company? Hey, they, you don't even know why I even they keep why I still there here. I day here because I don't target the time where my money, my monthly money, they take enter. I can't see say you know they use one second pass. And that time I know say we they payroll for this company. No be your guy they use in hand to transfer. If not, I for don't come. Now even immediately the quarter they start, they start to work another place. See say me alone a day here they do this nonsense. See you, you see you, this calabar winch. You be woman, we get man, structure. You be like, I don't know whether I'm a gym. You be, if they walk, if they be gym instructor. If you try and next time, I go to the house, I don't have to play with you again. I don't say, this one, I'm going to be, say, I'm going to be. My don't even open your mouth to talk to me like that. What do you mean by that? Oh, you have finished looking at me, you call me Unamikot. Even you could not feel. My Abbasi, you will do nothing. You never say if you're being at me. You cannot do anything. You will do nothing. Nothing. You cannot do anything. You open your mouth, you say, I will do nothing. Yes, you can do nothing. I ain't eh, no. Immediately I was there. The spirit told me something. Say, eh no. Eh no, my daughter, go. Oh, when you go there, off the meal to bring back the spirit back to the house. Okay. And now, that is what I did exactly. Now, so the same spirit go call me. Oh, being there. Oh, being there. Me, they know. Was that a slap? Now, so I go, you slap. Come on, your teeth. You didn't tell me how you the plabby. That same spirit go. Now you go tell me how to kill you. Oh, being said, you will not try it. Okay. You see this compare? This house that me and you, we are occupancies. Uh, my Abbasi, you will not try it. Saliva, when they touch my face, not too much. He cannot do you anything. Not too much. Yeah, yeah, next next thing, thing like now, I'm going to you. I'm going to give it to you now. You, you want to beat me? I'm going to give it to you. Okay, don't do anything. You want me to try it? Are you standing up, Peter? You want me to try it? Are you coming close? Now, make the Lord come say, I'm going to beat you, man. You cannot do anything. Try it, man. Don't know. Please. Are you hold? Don't hold me. Don't hold me, man. Don't hold me, man. Come on, come on. You just say it. Eh no. Eh no. Eh no. Eh no. How many times did I call you? What don't stand? Now what that too? You're telling me you did not sign that agreement. And yet your signature and thumbprint are all over the document. And even your personal stamp. I swear, Father, I did not sign any documents. I swear. You swear? What about the 800 million that was paid into your personal account? Swear you know nothing about that. I got the alert, but I thought it was a mistake. Before the next day, the money was gone. I swear, I am telling you the truth. I will you shut up, stop all this swear, swear, swear. You are getting me angry with this oh, swear. Darling. Please, you have to really take it easy. Now, don't you. tell me to take it easy on him. You cost all this. You have all this while supported this boy. 
You made me to hand over everything to him against my wish. So I am now to take the blame, huh? Oh yes, you should take full blame. You should take full blame. I think he might be right. Because part of the documents Mr. Collins signed said they had the right to take the company after Tremor. That is, if they really want to do so. That you say that taking them to court would be a waste of money and resources. But if you still want the fight, you can claim that the signature was manipulated. Even the agreement fee that was paid into his account was part of the fund in the company, which the bank can bear a witness to, because they are still tracing where the money was in your file. Father, honestly, I am so sorry about this whole mess. I know nothing about it. I will you shut up, shut up. Mommy, where are you? Okay, I'm waiting. Difficult times, be your same. Don't give up, cause time is the best. It's God that gives joy, it's not human being. Just know that difficult times are not sent to destroy you. She's the one that is supposed to take those useless drugs. Now get out of my presence before I do something crazy. But at least take your medication. Oh, shut up! You're the cause of all this nonsense. Yes, you're the cause of all this rubbish. Are you not? You are the cause of all this nonsense. You know it. Silly ass. I caught you. You are the cause of all this problem. You are the cause. Stop it, don't I? Don't I love it. I love it. I would smoke out the light out of you. You were supposed to be dead. She did not. She did not. I was the person that arranged the supposed death. As I speak, hired assassins are out there waiting to kill her and the unborn baby. Why not call the police to arrest them immediately? No, dog. Calling the police will not solve the problem. The same people that send those assassins can equally send another set of assassins. Please, Doc, I do not want to lose my cousin. Fake her death. What? Fake it.
Why, Mike? I gave you everything you wanted in life. Why are you against me, Mike? Why? You gave me everything that I wanted, and you think so. Che, I hope you remember your secretary, Cheetah, that got missing some 26 years back. She is my sister. Your evil wife here conspired with some evil man and got my sister drowned inside the river. An unarmed night watch witnessed the scene and rescued her. Yes, she died at the hospital. All she could say to me was, Rose! And she died because you threatened to suck her if she refuses to sleep with you. I wanted to strike. I wanted to strike. But let's inspect her. Oh, you stopped me. He stopped me because he said, there is no concrete evidence to nail you. And that was why. I needed one. So I convinced Rose to make you employ my cousin, Anne. Because I know you will never find her attractive because of her age and her size. I needed to be convinced. Yes. I needed her to get the information that I needed. To know why your wife here, her name should be mentioned before my sister died. All what you're saying is Arant nonsense. You don't have any evidence to prove it. Is that what you think? Well, the disappearance of your loyal servant, Mark Four, and Storm shouldn't be a mystery to you any longer. I arrested them 15 years ago. My four died five years ago without saying a word. What a loyal servant. And Stone? Still in jail, but a born again Christian. He confessed and we had it. And Ted, how they have killed for you over the years. But that was not what I wanted. Your accusations are not concrete. What about this new guy? You still have the inspector? The assassins you sent to assassinate Mr. King and his son. Mr. Donald Okoro, my interest you to know that I have a twin for you. A boy and a girl. Cat! Mom? Come, sweetheart. Mr. Donald. Kate here is your biological child, your daughter. We lost the boy 15 years ago. And I vowed to make sure I bring you down to zero with everything that is left in me. Let me bust your bubbles. Collins here is not your biological son. That is not possible. That is not possible. Rose, tell me it's not true. Tell me. She is smart. I don't know what she's talking about. I don't know what she is talking about. Of course you do. You lost your pregnancy at four months. Which it's sure not is because you are sleeping with younger boys. Like your husband. 
who was busy with everything under the skirt. What a couple. And in order to give him the air he so desired, he pretended nothing happened and flew to America to adapt. Unchecked. Rose, this is not true. This is not true. You're mad! You are insane! Jenny. Chief Okuru Duna. Not only feeding under the sun. Still. Why the extra words you used on me when you pushed me out of your empire. So, what brings you back? Shall we walk on the line? When you face difficult times, be your say, don't give up, cause time is the base, it's God that gives. Child is not human being. Just know that difficult times are not sent to destroy you.